Authorities in Australia are investigating the deadly crash of an Osprey aircraft during military training exercises that killed three U.S. Marines and critically injured five others. Fox's Alexandria Hoff has more. Well, on top of the three who have died, we know that five Marines were transported to the hospital in serious condition. Others received treatment right there on the ground. The crash happened at 9.30 a.m. local time on Melville Island, which is about 35 miles off the Darwin coast. No civilians were injured. Australian officials say that two U.S. Marine Osprey had taken off from Darwin, headed toward the Tiwi Islands when reports of a crash came in. We acknowledge that this is a terrible incident. The Northern Territory government stands by to offer what Whatever assistance is required. We have stood up a number of systems in the Northern Territory to respond to this incident. We are well resourced and well practiced in the Northern Territory in responding to emergencies. According to the Marine Rotational Force Darwin, the U.S. Marines aboard the Osprey were flying as part of joint training with Australia and other countries. That was called Exercise Predators Run. The Osprey is the primary transport aircraft for the Marines. It allows for vertical takeoff and landings while traveling in the air like a turboprop. Since 2012, the tilt rotor aircraft has seen six fatal crashes, causing at least 19 Marine Corps deaths. Three similarly died in 2017 off of Australia's coast. Now, this is the second aircraft crash of the week for the Marine Corps. On Thursday, Major Andrew Mettler died in an F-18 Hornet crash during a training exercise near San Diego. The commanding general of the 2nd Marine Aircraft Wing stated this, quote, we mourn the loss of one of our brothers who was devoted to the Marine Corps' mission, and it is our duty to continue forward in a manner that would reflect his devotion. On today's deadly incident, Australia's Prime Minister and Defense Secretary offered their condolences. So far this year, 18 U.S. service members have been killed in military aircraft crashes. In Washington, Alexandria Hoff, Fox News.